I've been struggling for the last couple of weeks at work because I'm on a mini cut right now. I'm trying to lose fat and get lean and fit for an upcoming family event that I have in a few weeks. And I've been noticing I'm getting extra hungry during the day at work and I'm way more tempted to eat the treats and the snacks that my coworkers are bringing in. So I'm gonna show you guys three super tasty and lazy high protein snacks that I'm taking to work this week to help me feel full and satisfied and not tempted to eat the treats so that I can stay on track and meet my goal. I'm making protein toffee dip and apple slices, cheesy and ham and rice cake kit and turkey pepperoni and mini yolk parfait. So let's start with the apple slices and the protein dip. And this is what you're gonna need. You could get an apple and slice it yourself. But to save time and because this is lazy, I already bought pre-sliced ones from my local grocery store in Canada, Zayers. So literally, there we go. A package of slices of apples. Calorie wise, 38 cows for the package in case you're looking for reference. I'm literally going to stick that in a container. We're also going to need 10 grams of protein powder. I'm using Maple Cookie by Hoodult HTLT Subs. This is like one of the best for flavoring Greek yogurt. Use Code Nicole to save yourself 10% because it is the best for yolk. Half a cup of plain fat-free Greek yogurt and I'm using the Kirkland, the Costco brand. And then we're gonna need some score bits. These are just like toffee bits for baking. So I've got half a cup of the yogurt measured in a container already. I'm going to put my protein powder in here and I'm gonna stir it until it's really well combined. And then I'm gonna put the lid on and it'll be ready to go for my dippers. That, oh my gosh, it smells good. Okay. So this is literally, it is good to go. My apple slices and I've got my yogurt dip. I'm gonna have a spoon on the side. I'm gonna measure out my toffee bits. What I'm gonna do before I eat this, when I take it to work, is I'm gonna pour the toffee bits, a teaspoon of them, into my dip and then I'm gonna dip my apples in it. Protein toffee dip with apple slices and this is how I'm gonna package it just so you can see I got this container from Walmart and this one as well so I'm gonna put my apples my toffee bits and my spoon in there and then put my apple slice I mean my yogurt on top and that one is ready to go. So all these snacks too are under 200 calories and between 15 and 21 grams of protein. So this one, 165 cows, two grams of fat, 18 grams of carbs, and 21 grams of protein. We're gonna move on. I'm calling this ham and spready cheese with rice cakes. Before I do, I've lost 130 pounds and kept it off for eight years. If you wanna know the exact meals and portions I ate to lose the weight, I have weight loss eBooks you can buy. The links are down below. Code Nicole will save you 10%. And the reason I'm making this vid is that I'm, the one thing I learned on my journey, I have to set myself up for success every single day. And how I do that is by having super easy to prep snacks that are low calorie and high protein on hand at all times because it helps me be less likely to eat things that I don't want to, and the extra protein in them help me feel full because protein lowers your hunger hormone called ghrelin. So that's always like really helped me stay on track. So what I learned and sassy, like my camera boy husband, <laughs> he's lost the same amount of weight as me and kept it off for the same amount of years. What we learned is when you're trying to lose weight, like your head or the mind will look for any excuse to go off track. And so like, yeah, you might be going, well, I can just go cut an apple. Like, why would I buy the pre-slice? Because there are some days I don't wanna cut an apple. I don't wanna do anything other than the two seconds it took me to make that snack. So by having no excuses, I literally have super tasty food I look forward to that is ready. There's no excuse. I love my diet. And when I start getting cravings or start getting tempted by treats at work, 
because I, I give myself what I want on cheat days and stuff. So when I get tempted by other food, I know that's a sign I need to change things up or I need to add a snack, like build it into my day. And so that's why I've done this because that's not normal for me. So I listen to my body and I go, okay, time to change things up. And I'm making three of them because I'm gonna make up you know, these three and then make a couple for the rest of the week. And I made a variety so that I don't get bored and I look forward to a new one that I take to work every single day. So let's move on to the cheesy rice cake ham thingy that I'm making. And for this one, I've got one of these compartment containers also from Walmart and a laughing cow cheese container. This one is the herb and garlic. As long as it's 25 cows per cheese wedge, just choose whatever flavor you want if you're gonna do this. And then I've got some butter popcorn rice cakes. You can choose other flavors, but the calories we're going for is 35 calories a rice cake. We're gonna need two of those. And then some black forest ham. And I'm just using extra lean black forest ham and it is 60 calories for four slices. I'm gonna use three. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take three slices out and you don't have to do this step, but I find the deli meat like in the package, it's a little slimy. So I just pop it on a paper towel and then I'm just gonna blot the paper towel onto the ham and then I'm gonna roll these babies up. Let's do it. Get a little roll out, you can do it. <laughs> um, and then I just roll it and I'm just gonna put them in this little compartment there. And then I'm gonna take two of these. There we go. I'm gonna put a little laughing cow on the side. Forgot to bring my butter knife over, but I will be putting a butter knife with this snack so that I can spread the cheese on. So literally, like you can eat it all separate, which sometimes I do, or you can put it all together, spread the cheese on, put the ham and make a sandwich. Whatever you like to do, it's all your choice. That is my second snack ready to go. For that one, 170 cows, three grams of fat, 17 grams of carbs, and 19 grams of protein. The last one, I'm calling this my mini yog parfait, because yog is my short form for yogurt. Yeah, we got that. <laughs> okay, um, and turkey pepperoni, which we're going to be using one turkey pepperoni, and this is the lean turkey pepperoni from Costco. I know I talk about this all the time, the Grimm's. It literally does not taste like turkey. I love this stuff. And then we're also gonna need some high protein cereal, and I'm using Vector. First thing I'm gonna do is I have this bento box that I also got from Walmart, and I'm going to take my pepperoni, one of these, and I'm just gonna roll it in some plastic wrap like that. And there she is. Oh, I forgot to tell you, we probably need Greek yogurt. <laughs> so this is the one that I'm using. It's the Oikos 0% and it is triple berry. Let me find you the English version. Uh, blended, blended berry mix. So one of these, it's 70 cows. So as long as you're getting 70 cows and eight grams of protein. So I'm gonna pop one of these in here like that. And I will also put a spoon with this one. We're gonna need 100 grams of straws. So I'm gonna take these and I'm going to, I've already measured them out, cleaned them. I'm just gonna slice them into this container. Just shove them in there. <laughs> <laughs> Pop it in here. Now I'm gonna measure my vector two tablespoons of the Vector cereal. One. It's and a great two. like granola hack. It so. is because it's low calorie the Vector and it's higher protein. So this is what I use for granola in place of, because granola can be really high in cows. So I'm literally gonna do that and then like I said, I'm gonna add a spoon in here and that that's it. When I open this up, I'm gonna dump my straws, dump in my um, palinka, what's this? Eat it, and then eat my turkey pepperoni. And look at this. 
Look at this, guys. How That was like five minutes to make these cute little snacks, wasn't it? Now, for the mini yogurt parfait and turkey pepperoni, it's 172 cows, 4 grams of fat, 20 grams of carbs, and 15 grams of protein. So, this is the key, friends. Have super easy to prep snacks on hand and made at all times that have protein so you'll stay full and that are tasty so that you look forward to eating them and you literally go, I'm hungry, okay, nom, 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 and that's it. No excuses, fail safe, and that is why I've been able to lose the weight and keep it off for so long because I always set myself up for success. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm really excited to take these to work. I kind of want to eat all of them right now, but I will save them for work. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to check out this vid and this vid because I always got sustainable weight loss tips that make your journey fun and not a punishment. And just you can just love life, enjoy your food, and just lose and wait for real people in the real world. What else do you want? <laughs> I love you. Thanks for watching. Appreciate your love and support. Catch you in the next big cuties. Now. Whoa. See ya. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.